Hello folks, Jonathan Milo here with a, another review of two trumpets, both copper belt. I've got a Del Quadro, wait that's not the easiest to say, Del Quadro custom trumpet here, and I have got an old Kong 12B. Both of them have, of course, the um, nice copper bell and brass bodies, both of them. Um, Notice how much larger, of course, the uh, vintage cons did have smaller bells, probably a little more than four and a half inch, probably close. The Del Quadro is five and three quarter. Boy, doesn't it look bigger than an inch and an eighth difference? Um, anyway, great trumpets, both, and uh, we're going to play them both, three different ranges, three different mouthpieces, very simple chorus, uh, I'm not trying to uh, exemplify anything other than the raw tonality, tone, of the um, trumpets. Okay, church course I heard years ago, actually cannot find it anywhere. Uh, everything, everything, you become everything to me. Everything, everything, you become everything to me. There's more to it than that, but I can't remember the uh, words, and so I don't usually play that. But anyway... Give you an idea of the low register starting off with the Reeves C to J, and this is the Del Quadro custom. One other thing I wanted to show you look how far forward the valves are placed on this model. All an effort to balance, and the balance is pretty good considering the size of the bell. But um, just an uh, interesting thing that I noted when I was taking pictures of the two horns a few minutes ago. Okay, let me. Uh, just hit a straight note so I can uh, make sure my lips in shape. Okay. And the con 12B. Now I have to say, my impression behind the bell is that the Del Quadro has a slightly fluffier tone. And that probably is because the throat is not much larger, but the bell flare is. And because of that, it seems to dispel the sound more, where the con, it feels to me like the con has a little less feedback and is just throwing it forward. The um, Del Quadro, with that deep flugel-like mouthpiece, really sounds quite like a flugel from where I am. Okay, the next uh, mouthpiece I'm gonna use is a uh, Reeves Proviance 9A, and uh, it's uh, probably a little shallower than your Bach 3C or what have you but um, not a whole lot, a little bit larger throat, and perhaps a slightly larger backboard. Same chorus, just gonna raise it up a fourth. So it's a Del Quattro.
freely. Um, just, the sound just sounds so creamy, so thick. Um, both horns, it's just a, a pleasure to be able to uh, play around with so many horns. Okay, uh, I've been working a lot of exercise on my lip recently. Uh, parts of it have felt very weak, so the last couple of days I really pushed myself and I feel it today. I uh, will try not certainly screech range. My upper range is nothing to write home about, but we'll try and at least get it up into a register where uh, you'll get an idea if you intended to use this trumpet for that. This is a Reeves Extra Shallow. No, it's a Reeves Shallow V, excuse me. SV Shallow V. Steel, amazing valves. I don't know how Khan did it. You know, this horn is 80 years old, um, 1937, and uh, well, almost uh, 1939, excuse me. Um, just the valves seem a little bit slower. The Del Quadro is a newer horn, and I've mentioned in other videos. Um, Mike put this out, it was the 11th horn he put out. I think it was probably about 11 or 12 years ago. Don't think it's been played that much but the valves are unbelievable. I knew he was using ambassador bodies on his first few horns, and I wondered what he would be able to do with the valves. I'm extremely impressed. Uh, as, as good a feel as I've ever had, just uh, not too much bounce, but a real live feel, very impressive. The uh, Del Quadro is a much easier horn to produce tone on. I'm anxious to see what it sounds like from the camera side of the horn, and uh, we'll check it out. Thanks, as always, for tuning in. Hit the like button if you like it. If you don't like it, go to another video quickly. <laughs> um, hit the subscribe button if you like. We've got a plethora of horns right now that we're trying to compare, and uh, I need to get into some mouthpieces. I've got a good uh, sample of reeves and proviances that I should be doing some uh, little... Um, individual reviews on. Thanks so much for visiting as always. Have a great day.